Let's take a look at some more environments. Grasslands are flat and open areas in which grasses grow. In temperate regions, they are located between forests. In tropical regions, grasslands are found between deserts and rainforests. They typically receive 50 to 90 centimetres of rain in a year. While temperatures can be extreme, they are usually between minus 20 degrees and plus 30 degrees Celsius. The grass can be different sizes, from a couple of millimetres to two metres tall. Grasslands are an important habitat for many mammals and birds, including zebras, giraffes and buffalo. Wetlands can be described as the place where land-based and aquatic ecosystems meet. They are found in and around lakes, ponds, rivers and coastal areas. Marshes and swamps are examples of wetlands and are home to animals including turtles, frogs and crocodiles. Deserts are commonly defined as land that receive very little rainfall. Temperatures vary a lot and during the day it can get as high as 50 degrees Celsius while at night it can drop to minus 20 degrees Celsius. Reptiles are active during the day as their cold blooded bodies soak up as much heat as they can. There are no trees in the desert, only low growing shrubs and grasses where there is enough water. While most people think of deserts as being expanses of sand, most deserts are in fact made up of rocks and stone and some are even made up of ice. These are called polar lands. The polar lands are regions in the areas surrounding the North and South Poles. The North Pole is located in the Arctic region, while the South Pole is in the Antarctic region. These spots do not receive much rain or snow, and even though there is water all over these areas, it is all in the form of ice. Some of these polar deserts are located over land, like the majority of Antarctica, but some of them are simply on enormous glaciers over water, like in the Arctic Ocean. In these frozen deserts, very little can survive. But animals like polar bears in the Arctic, penguins in the Antarctic, seals and birds make their home there. South of the Arctic polar deserts is the tundra. Tundra is land that is so cold, some of the soil freezes creating permafrost. The permafrost extends from 250 to 450 metres into the ground, so only very specialised plants and animals are able to survive there. Animals and plants that do make their homes in the tundra include reindeer and foxes. Some of these creatures live in the tundra year round, but most of them migrate north only during the summer months, living in the warmer areas to the south during the harsh winter. Mountains are another place with harsh weather, including some conditions similar to polar deserts and tundra. At the bottom of mountains, there are usually forests, which extend up to a point at which the soil becomes too rocky and the air becomes too thin for trees to grow. This is called the tree line. Above it, there are some grasses, flowering alpine plants, and lichens, but these thin out the further up you get. This is called the snow line. The further up the mountain, the harsher the conditions. On top of the tallest mountains, the air is very thin, but even with these conditions, some animals survive, such as mountain goats, llamas, doll sheep, and birds.